Jack uh, Sheberg is uh, joining us in the studio right now, Okemos native, graduate of the USC Film School, and the man behind the movie The Key, uh, which you can see it. Uh, it's at Celebration Cinema right now? Uh, not right now. Next Thursday. Next Thursday. Yeah, it's okay. showing uh, one day only for three shows, 515, 730, and 945. All right. Well, tell us about the movie. The movie, The Key, stars uh, Caitlin, who I believe is on uh, the phone right now, as a young woman who grew up without a father and a mother who would never tell her anything about the father. On her 18th birthday, with the mom working the graveyard shift, uh, she gets a phone call from someone who says, get the key and meet me at the airport, then hangs up on her. She's known about the key ever since she was a little girl, but again, her mom never told her what, what it meant or what it was for, so she has to decide, who is this guy? Could he be my father? Should I take the key? Should I meet him at the airport? Of course, if she doesn't, there's no movie, so she does, and uh, drama and mystery and suspense ensue. Are you the writer of the, uh, the yes, movie? Yes, yes. So you've just gone from a blank piece of paper to a uh, feature film? Correct. What's that process like? It's uh, long and uh, amazing. Um, every part you think is the hardest, and uh, it turns out that getting it seen is, is really and truly the hardest. <laughs> Don Cochran uh, also with us, the uh, star of The Key, one of the stars of The Key. Uh, are you the dad? Yeah, I play okay. the father in the film. And, um, yeah, it's, it's been, uh, we, we put a lot of time, a lot of evenings and weekends uh, doing this, and. Uh, you have to really have a passion for it if you know if if you are are doing this um and you have you know you have your job you know your full-time real job and then you have a job uh, as far as working as an actor or, mm -hmm. or you know filmmaker or writer producer you know those, those are things you want to pursue and you got to just keep working hard at it as you know yourself many years continuing working in radio it's just something you start from the ground up and just follow up with your passion exactly right why well, I, yeah. I know about that i wrote a book myself so i know yeah. about uh, doing things when you're not uh, not uh, uh, doing your other job or, or as you say your your real job which i imagine you prefer the the uh, the not real job though right, right yeah right. absolutely trying to make it looking at it as, as maybe a career move in the future or whatever you know that's how you got to think about and it. and amanda we have another one of the stars uh, we on do caitlin's on the other end of our line right now hi caitlin how are you I'm good. How are you? Oh, great, thank you. What was it like uh, making this movie? Um, really interesting. Um, Jack actually kind of got me involved on a whim. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> I'm primarily a theater actor, and this was actually one of my first um, movies being shot on camera. So it was really, really fun and interesting and a great learning experience. Where did you uh, shoot the movie? Uh, all over the place. We shot a little in Lansing, Williamston, Mason, Fenton, Linden, Fowlerville, mm -hmm. Howell, Traverse City. <laughs> So, <laughs> all over the place, wherever people would let us on their land, basically. Was this yeah. a, a project that was aided by the... Uh, the uh, uh, no, no, this was much, much too small, uh, as in, you know, all volunteers, cast and crew equipment was either borrowed or mm -hmm. stuff that people had. So it was made on the good old blood, sweat, and tears. How about that? Yeah. That's, uh, that's, uh, that's, uh, that's an additional challenge to you, to, 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 to have to work on a... Oh, on a, on a small budget, and still be able to make it work. Definitely, and and Caitlin and Don and all the other actors were just amazing about giving their time and giving up, you know, weekends. And I'd say we got to shoot it now, and it's you know 35 degrees, and you're supposed to be in the middle of summer. So now act. <laughs> right. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Exactly. So you know, I, I I've read some stories about the making of uh, of. Uh, the Kevin Costner movie uh, with the the farm. What's that? Why can't I remember the name? Field of, of the Dreams. Dreams. Field of Dreams. Yeah. And they shot so early in the morning that one of the problems they had was you could see the breath, the breath, the frost when the uh, actors were speaking, and they would have to redo several scenes just because it was a, it was an unusually cold summer in Iowa. The summer they uh, they uh, they shot the thing, and they that was one of the problems that uh, came up. Hmm. You can, some of these things you just can't plan for in advance. Exactly. Yeah. So, uh, I mean, tell me how how. How do you feel about the finished product, I guess is what I, I'm going to say. Can we expect to see this in widespread release at some point? How well do you expect it to be received? Well, it's hard to say. Uh, yeah. Um, realistically, I think it's going to be received well, mm -hmm. but the jump from that to really getting it out is, uh, is a long one. You can do the film festival route, but it's... It's really, really hard to get it into any sort of distribution beyond selling Blu-rays and DVDs. Um, we may be able to find an independent distributor that could, you know, do something with it. But 
it's pretty tough unless you really get a lot of good feedback you got a lot of word of mouth and and reviews and we've gotten everything we've got back so far is probably an a minus so the number one thing you need right now is for people to go out to the celebration cinema next thursday night december 8th and, and see the movie the key correct all right and the showtime is at uh is when do you know yet? Yep, yeah, five fifteen, seven thirty, and nine forty-five. All right. Well, yeah. best of luck to you. Local filmmaker makes good. We hope is the headline down the road. And so thanks for coming I. in to join us Thank today. You. Thank you. Thanks for joining Thank us you. on the phone, Caitlin. Thank you. All right. Take care. All right. The movie's the key. It's at the Celebration Cinema, Thursday, December eighth. And again, uh, you'll see the uh, the uh, showtimes when you go on their website. Does the movie have a website? Uh, no, it's got a Facebook page and. Uh, People can find it there, and okay. they, they can see the trailer on YouTube also. Outstanding.